I don't want none of that smoke. But I do got a question. Mm-hmm. Buy, 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 buy some smoke. Tyreek Hill. Oh, the man no. say, Ooh, no, no, I'm just asking, because this. this is what, I, this is what I'm saying. He said in the 60. Mm-hmm. Now, I watch. No allows as fast as hell, but he don't have the best start. So you think if it was a 60, Tyreek had a chance? I don't know what Tyreek's start looked like. You know, because when I be watching, Noah, track, you Noah can have the best hell, start. He closed. Yes, like, he, he does. don't have the best start, he but does. he closes. But that's why Tyree said sixty and not the hundred. Yeah, because he gonna get ran down that hundred. That's what show. I'm saying. So but that's why 60, I think he said the sixty. I still think it still would be pretty close. Like Noah has ran some great sixties with oh, the man terrible fast. starts. Oh, the man fast. So oh, the man fast. I don't yeah. know. And then I think I think when they talked recently, I think Ty Hill ended up changing it to a forty or something like that. I think. <laughs> keep trying to so take the I don't care. Down, I don't know. You know the man, like the, the man, man twenty. The man when the man reached top speed, it's crazy now. Yeah, now it's, I know. It's crazy. Yeah, once he hit top end, it's it's over with. Yeah, and, and listen, let me just say this. I'm a fan, but he be tripping. And, 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 and it's all Everybody good. have their moments. Gotta, yeah, yeah, I ain't got to listen. I ain't got to like everything you say, everything you do. Mm-hmm. I'm still a fan of you, bro. But why he say that if you win a championship, that you ain't a, you ain't a world champion? I don't understand that. Like, just, um, it, you can have I, your I, opinion I, on I haven't even fully, I ain't even a lot to, I've heard the conversation around it, but I haven't fully listened to what he said verbatim or any. He or said I just know he is a what? That's I what know he, said. he just sounds just like that. Champions yeah, are wet. I just know hey, he hey, got hey, the NBA round up. We don't mean to, we don't mean to put you on here because Noah's not on here. We'd love to have that though. But no, I ain't trying to I'm put with, him on I'm the spot. I'm, no, no, no. I'm with you though, UD. He's tripping on some stuff because the best world players come over and play in our league anyway. Yes. So it's there's, there's yes. a conversation that we can have, but yes. this has nothing to do with UTT. But Noah likes to talk about that. The best. Foreign players, European players are coming over and playing in our league. Yes, so it's world championships are world championship. We yeah. got two of them, UD. Oh, you got right. three of them. I got three. I got two. Yeah, I, I, you, can't, I you can't diminish my goddamn that. championship. <laughs> we won one. It's just uh, San Antonio. What minor did you be on that team? You sure Ain't was, nothing Coach. better came out of Spain. Tony, Park, Tony, hey, Tony Park. Ain't nothing better came out of French than Tony Parker. Ain't nothing better yeah. came out of Spain than Manuel Ginobili. So I'm a goddamn world champion in my eyes. <laughs> I, so, TT, I, so, CT, I asked you this question before. You're so young and UD is so old. You grew up watching him a little bit? Was he, yes, was, of course. You you know, I grew up in Miami, born and raised, so I watched. <laughs> 305 for life, dog. That's I watched the do. Heat, you know, when y'all went that back to back. I definitely watched that. You know, I had to go out to the parade. You know, we had that, wore that all white. So mm-hmm. I definitely I definitely watched him compete. You watched him too, right? Yes, of course. Because you, you told me a story earlier before the show started, and I ain't, I ain't like it. But <laughs> we gonna, you can tell that story again, please. I don't even understand it, yes, first of all, because so you got to elaborate was, and make it make sense. But I don't go know. ahead, just I run was, that by. I was it made a, it made a of sense. <laughs> I was young. I was watching the Heat. Grew up in Miami. I'm a Heat fan. I watched you. I'm like, okay, that's the OG. He get down. I had It was Mike Miller. It was Wade, Bosch, Braun. It was all of y'all. And I'm like, okay. He was balling. He was going crazy. I'm like, okay, I'm on Instagram. That's not used to be changing my little Instagram handles here and there. And at one point, I think it was like Future Wife. Then it was Rich Homie Corn something. And then it was like Mike Miller Wife. And I kept it there for a minute. And then uh, my best friend, my little sister, was like, okay, little Mike Miller. <laughs> so I used to be watching a good beat. And then when I did a podcast, I told her today, I was like, guess who I'm going on the podcast with? And I was like, Mike Miller? And she just bust out laughing. I said, yeah, give me how. She said, now how you got that? Look at your life just full circle. <laughs> so we just used to be making fun. TT is a smart guest. She's my favorite guest that we've had. I ain't a hater, but I'm just saying. Favorite guest we've had. She's smart. Yeah. I was just doing stuff. Yeah. Nah, that's cold. No, that's cold, though. No. We had our day. We appreciate you. We had our day. Hey, talk to me about this U.S.-Jamaica rivalry. What What is that like? Um. So the U.S.-Jamaica rivalry? I would say it's more so a rivalry with the fans. Mm. Um, you know, when uh, sports bring, bring people together, you know, that's how people mm-hmm. um, build relationships and friendships. But it's nothing too crazy off the track. We support each other off the track. Um, I've watched Shelly growing up, her, Carmelita, Allison, Veronica Campbell-Brown. So, you know, I've always looked up to other runners from other countries as well. And I think when we step on the track, USA versus Jamaica, it, we just put on a show. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, and then you have Great Britain coming in now, you know, with Daryl. And um, Dina, so you know it's it's a great rivalry when you step on the track. You know you're going to get a show, and when it comes down to the relays and stuff, it's a matter of who's going to come out on top because you have so many great athletes on paper. But it's a matter of are they going to put it together this day, or who's going to come on top this day, or is this athlete feeling this way or that way? Um, I definitely say I enjoy it. Um, I have fans that's also Jamaicans, and they make sure they let me know like, hey, I'm a I'm Jamaican, but I love you. 
um, in USA and stuff like that. So I feel like it's a great rivalry. It's something that's going to always be there. You know, the OGs paved the way. Merlin Adi, mm. um, Flo Jo, you had so Evelyn Ashford. You had so many great athletes from both the USA and Jamaica that was dominant in their time and was able to pave the way for us to be able to come behind them. And then, you know, you had Jamaica um, with Shelly Ann and then mm -hmm. um, Elaine and Sharika, you know, and just being able to see what they do and us going from watching them to competing alongside them just to show how dominant Jamaica is um, when it comes to the sprints and how dominant the USA can be as well. And I feel like it's going to always be a rivalry because there's always younger coming up. Like right now with Jamaica on the younger side, you got Alana Reed, you got the Clayton twins. And on the USA side, you have the younger athletes, uh, myself, Melissa, Shakari, you know, so it's a great time. You know, you have Shanti that's also with USA and so many more other names. I just feel like the rivalry is going to always be there. And as long as it's a healthy rivalry, um, I think the athletes will always enjoy it. The fans will enjoy it. I think it just more so becomes out of hand sometimes amongst the fans as opposed to the athletes. Like the athletes will um, congratulate each other off the track, on the track. You know, once we finish, the women are hugging or handshaking. So I feel like it's just a healthy rivalry.